Well, I surely hope you're enjoying your weekend so far. Don't let those weekend showers at least ruin your plans for today. As we go throughout your Saturday and Sunday, well, Sunday may turn a little colder out there. Let's look at our Perrysburg cam right now. You can see those clouds out there, but we'd also do see some sun trying to peek out just a little bit as we go throughout this morning. Look at those showers out there. Most of them are just east of our area. Still seeing some showers redevelop just along this area uh, as we take a closer look just in the Wood County, even into look at Lucas County. You may see a few light showers out there as you go throughout the next 30 minutes. So look at those current temperatures just into the mids, upper 40s this morning, 45 in Washington, 45 in Adrian, 47 right back here at home. Take it those hour by hour temperatures. Well, we won't warm up too much this weekend. It's just what we saw last weekend where we were in the 80s. Not going to be the case this weekend. By 4 p.m., we'll be into the mid 50s. Some places could be the upper 50s, 59 in Fremont, 55 in Port Clinton, 57 in Tiffin. But as we go into tonight, oh, we cool off nicely. But I wake up on Sunday, it's going to be a cool one out there. We'll see temperatures into the mid 30s. Some places, even Hillsdale, Adrian, Brian could see 33 degrees for wake up on Sunday. Overall, not going to be the best day. It will be a dreary day, but we'll warm up as eventually as we go just around 1 p.m. on Sunday. Well, those temperatures are going to be to the upper 40s, possibly even 50. So we'll warm up a little bit as we go throughout Sunday. But overall, it's going to be a cold day out there. And speaking of Sunday, well, that Glass City Marathon will be on Sunday morning. We'll see a few brief flurries, but overall going to be cool and cloudy. Where those temperatures are going to be right around 37 degrees for the start by 9 a.m. will be around 39 degrees by 11 a.m. 42 degrees. So if you're heading out to the Glass City Marathon, may want to at least wear those layers. Uh, it will be a cold one out there. As far as those rain chances, well, they'll be on and off throughout this weekend around 4 p.m. We'll still see some spotty showers out there, but it won't be a washout or day Saturday or Sunday, so that it is good news. My Sunday morning, we can actually be mostly clear and even seeing some sun as you wake up on Sunday. Eventually, as we head into late morning hours, those clouds redevelop. We'll see still a few spotty showers out there as you go throughout the afternoon hours and even the evening hours of Sunday as those clouds do in fact return to our area for Sunday evening. Let's look at your umbrella forecast over the next four days. May need it still for Saturday, but as we go into your Sunday, you may need it at times. Overall, not gonna be a washout of a day. And eventually we're back dry by Monday before our next system rolls through as we head throughout Tuesday. Look at those high temperatures over the next 10 days. Not much warmth in the next 10 days at least. We go from 57 to 49 degrees. Eventually, we'll rise up into the upper 50s as we end the Wednesday. By Thursday, we're at 60 degrees. And eventually, we fall back down into the mid to upper 50s by the weekend. Here's a look at your extended forecast. Still got rain chances for Saturday and into Sunday. As we end the Monday, we're back dry. It's the same case for Tuesday. As we'll see some rain showers come roll back into our area. We'll get actually in the week. I'd say rather dry for us. Eventually by the weekend, well, we'll see some rain showers again, possibly for Saturday. But those temperatures are going to stay just into the upper 50s and close to 60 degrees over the next 10 days.